As the Delta variant continues to spread, more children are getting sick, and that has a lot of parents with infants and toddlers wondering how best to protect them from COVID-19, since a lot of them are not old enough to get the vaccine. Molly Jett spoke to a mom of two and a doctor to get some tips. Yes, I've talked to moms on Facebook and some as they've walked out of Atrium Health Navison's Children's Hospital. They all want to know the same thing, how to best protect their child from COVID-19. Brooke Carswell of Milledgeville has two daughters, a four-year-old and a 13-year-old. When it comes to the Delta variant, she's most concerned for her youngest daughter. She's smaller. She has a weaker immune system and there's nothing available. Right now, children under the age of 12 can't get vaccinated. With the girls back in school, Carswell worries about who they come in contact with. In fact, her youngest daughter, who isn't old enough to be vaccinated yet, got infected with COVID-19 somewhere, sometime last week. My youngest started having you know, sniffles on Tuesday, and Friday she was absolutely miserable. Now the three of them are quarantining and Carswell wishes she could have protected her daughters more. So what can you do to protect those who still aren't old enough for vaccination? Dr. Edward Clark with Beverly Knight Olson Children's Hospital says the first thing you can do is get vaccinated yourself. If you're able to get vaccinated, you should be vaccinated. That way you're decreasing your risk of catching uh, COVID as well as your risk of spreading that to your uh, infant or child. Second, make sure everyone around your young children is vaccinated. But be careful with who you're exposing them to. You know, if you're, uh, you know, have families that uh, aren't vaccinated, that's not who you want to go party with. Now, Dr. Clark also said washing your hands routinely is another thing you can do to protect children who still can't get vaccinated. In Macon, Molly Jett, 13 WMAZ News. Dr. Clark added, if you have an infant, breastfeeding is another way you can protect your infant. That's because if you have antibodies from either having COVID-19 or getting vaccinated, you will then pass those along to your infant as well.